Hi friends, in this video, I'm gonna make a hand gesture controlled robo car. This gonna be a fun project. I hope you'll enjoy this video. So without further ado, let's start this video. As we know, it is time for Christmas and PCB GoGo have launched the greatest sale for the Happy New Year. Every day PCB GoGo choose one order randomly during December. The chosen order will be free of charge. Also, PCB GoGo offers the biggest coupon for this year, which is maximum $155 off. So grab your best discount on this Christmas and New Year sale. So hurry up, buy before it ends. Furthermore, PCB GoGo prepared the gift for the customers. Order above $60 will receive a surprising gift with their PCBs. You can go to the website of PCB GoGo or just click the link in the description below. If you are new to PCB GoGo, you can also get a $50 coupon. One more thing, don't forget to follow PCB GoGo on Twitter to get more Christmas giveaways such as Amazon gift cards and PCB GoGo cash. So scan the QR code on the screen to get more. If you are not subscribed to my channel, then do subscribe and don't forget to press the bell icon so you can get notified about my new videos. Follow me on Facebook and Instagram. I have a second channel, Canny Tech. Do check it out as well. Subscribe and support it. All the links are in the description. These are all the components we're gonna need for this project. This project is consist of two circuits. One is transmitter circuit and second one is receiver circuit. First, let's make the transmitter circuit. First, I'm gonna connect Arduino. After that, I'm gonna connect TP4056 module and connect its negative out pin to ground pin of Arduino. After that, I'm gonna connect an on off switch and connect its one pin to 5 volt pin of Arduino and its other pin to positive out pin of TP4056 module. After that, I'm gonna connect lithium ion cell and connect its positive pin to battery positive pin of TP4056 module and its negative pin to battery negative pin of TP4056 module. After that, I'm gonna connect 433 MHz transmitter module and connect its VCC pin to 5V pin of Arduino, its ground pin to ground pin of Arduino and its data pin to D2 pin of Arduino. After that, I'm gonna connect accelerometer and connect its VCC pin to 5V pin of Arduino, its ground pin to ground pin of Arduino and its X out pin to A0 pin of Arduino and its Y out pin to A1 pin of Arduino. So we have completed the connections for the transmitter circuit. Now let's make the receiver circuit. First, I'm gonna connect Arduino. After that, I'm gonna connect TP4056 module and connect its negative out pin to ground pin of Arduino. After that, I'm gonna connect to lithium ion cells and connect their positive pin to battery positive pin of TP4056 module and their negative pin to battery negative pin of TP4056 module. After that, I'm gonna connect an on off switch and connect its one pin to 5 volt pin of Arduino and its other pin to positive out pin of TP4056 module. After that, I'm gonna connect 433 MHz receiver module and connect its VCC pin to 5 volt pin of Arduino, its ground pin to ground pin of Arduino and its data pin to pin D2 of Arduino. 
After that, I'm gonna connect L298 motor driver module and connect its 12 volt and 5 volt pin to 5 volt pin of Arduino and its ground pin to ground pin of Arduino and connect its input 1 to pin D3 of Arduino, its input 2 to pin D4 of Arduino, its input 3 to pin D5 of Arduino, its input 4 to pin D6 of Arduino. After that, I'm gonna connect a DC gear motor and connect its one pin to output 3 of motor driver module and its other pin to output 4 of motor driver module. After that, I'm gonna connect another DC gear motor and connect its one pin to output 1 of motor driver module and its other pin to output 2 of motor driver module. So we have completed all the connections, now let's test the project. 